my name is Kathleen Sotomayor and I'm originally from Guatemala City, Guatemala. I'm pursuing a master's in global leadership. Hello, my name is Riley Cooper. I am from Houston, Texas, and I am majoring in intercultural studies and communication theory and minoring in Spanish. Bonjour, my name is Roland here. I'm from Burkina Faso, and my major is environmental science. Hola, tudo bem? My name is Diego Mota. I'm from Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, and I'm pursuing a Master's of Arts in Theological Studies. Namaste. My name is Abhinav Lal, and I'm from India. I'm pursuing my Master of Arts in Christian Ministry. What the Lord taught me the most here at DBU has been to surrender daily to my desires and to, my, and to being comfortable. He wanted me to grow in the aspect of trusting Him with my finances. I didn't think I was going to be able to come, but He strained my heart in different ways that I couldn't think possible, and He's been providing. So just that aspect of surrendering everything of me and being able to serve Him and being obedient has been a great learning that God has taught me while here at the view. While I have learned so much from my classmates, from my professors, from my peers, there's been nothing like what I've learned from the international community here at DBU. My friends have truly been my teachers. They've taught me about dance, communication, um, food, perspective, worldview, uh, values, culture, you name it. I am so incredibly grateful to them for all, the, all that they've shared with me. I feel so much more um, aware of the world outside of my own, outside of my own culture, and they've only made me more excited to go and explore it for myself. At DBU, I have learned to pursue the Lord wholeheartedly and remain faithful in the midst of challenges. Uh, DBU has enabled me to love His creation as God intends them to be loved. Uh, having been surrounded by different set of cultures, people with different ethnicities, speaking different languages, um, there is a common ground that we have in serving the God Almighty and becoming a light in this dark world. The most important thing I learned from DBU, uh, other than academics and all the obvious stuff, um, is uh, that work is worship. Everything you do, uh, it, it doesn't matter if it's at work, at home, if you're serving someone, you're working at something, if you do it with your whole heart, uh, you do it focusing on the Lord, it's, it's an expression of worship. And I learned that from my, my bosses at the web team. Uh, they, they keep repeating that. That's a model that we carry with us and it, it, it drives us forward in an, in an amazing way. So uh, I'm very thankful for the view for that as well. And uh, to be honest, uh, that's definitely the most impactful thing I've learned from the view. Uh, my favorite campus activity uh, was being part of the different event of international office. Uh, not only the events from my club, which is the African Student Union, but also like learning other culture through the events. One of my favorite activities here at DBU has been uh, being part of Bible studies or leading Bible studies on campus. I didn't think I was going to be able to do something like this, but the Lord taught me that I was able through Him. And so just being with people, community, and growing together, and going out and sharing the gospel with other people has been crazy amazing. So this has been one of my favorite activities here at DBU. I will be serving full-time in ministry. I have been appointed by Calvary Chapel as their worship leader and missions coordinator. More than 15,000 students uh, in the University of Texas, both Indian and American, need the gospel. We are witnesses of that gospel message of Jesus. I was lost, I was dejected and depressed, uh, but God gave me a new life. The cross transformed my life. And so my goal and my vision is to reach the students with that message because only Jesus saves and gives us a new life. And now that I'm graduating uh, from, with a master's uh, here at DBU, I'm going to serve uh, Dunkelby First Baptist Church as the youth minister. Uh, the, it has been my church family since I got here. Uh, it was actually introduced to me by a professor here, Dr. David Cook. He took me there for the first time and the church loved on me and my, my wife, Jessica. and. Uh, we just found our place. 
right? And they became our family. And now uh, they've invited me to serve there uh, as a youth pastor. I'm, I'm really excited about that. Uh, the thing I'm most thankful for DBU is the Christ-centered environment that DBU is providing and also the people that I met here, some of the great people, and I developed some friendship and some people became like family to me. I am so thankful to DBU for the education and the experience that it has provided me. I have had meaningful conversations and discussions, I have made valuable friendships, and I have learned impactful lessons here. Um, I know that this has been the place where the Lord has allowed me to grow into passions that I believe He set in me long ago, but never had the chance to really explore before coming to DBU. And so I know that when I look back at my time here, and I look back at DBU years from now, I will see it as not only the place where I had my four-year college experience, but as the place where the Lord um, molded me and grew me and prepared me for um, life and adulthood.